Hello. Hi. And welcome back. Like and subscribe. It, it, <clears throat> All right, we're Hi. in a we're in a historic site in the deep jungle. It's, a, it's possibly the spiciest thing we've ever done. Although it's been really bland so far. I mean, there's there's been some there's been some smoke. And where there's smoke, there's fire. And in this case, where there's acid, there is a acid breath breathing lizard. Oh yeah. My ho Stop. Stop that. Here we go. Put that little Cease. guy away. Yeah, put him back in your wrist. So we blew up probably the cool thing of the area. I mean, it, it gives us a good metric or baseline for what kind of things we can expect in this zone. <gasps> um, which is more of that. We have a chest. I'm hoping we don't blow that one up. Pop, pop, and that's how the lizards drop. I don't know. Is this anything? Sir? Sure hope that acid breath does not destroy that beautiful chest over there. I would hate for anything terrible to happen to it. I like how... grenade. I like how there's a little bit of variety to, like, the tiles for all of the different tart beards. Um, or even like beards in general. They all, I all have a little bit of variation. Well, oh, that's nothing. Resonance grenade is fine. Um, we like that. They're kind of like better, better explosive grenades. In fact, they're, they are better in some one way is that they destroy, um, like objects rather than shift them around. So it might be better for you. Well, we want to learn how to make that, so we don't want to throw that necessarily just yet. Urchin, urchins are worth quite a lot of XP for you. We we are hungry, but we're not inspired. We might want to cook from a recipe. You've got a campfire right there. Let's uh let's cook from a recipe, since we've got quite a a large body of uh you know things to cook from. Um. Or strength whenever you suffer eight times two or greater physical penetration you shank your opponent that's not great um let's go through them let's look at anything that gives us strength i guess or agility but we don't have too many agility ones as i understand uh heat resistance no corrosive breath no no a lot of these are not great i will be oh well strength bur and burrowing claws yeah i mean that's something we could make that Intimidate and burrowing claws. Pass on that. Uh, and AV and agility. That's not awful, but not really what we want. Ill and flaming ray. No. Nope. Intimidate and burrowing claws again. Um, let's mark that one as our favorite. Which one? The one you're hovering over. The yogurt with honey and creep flatbread. Uh, guaranteed to be tasty. Plus four strength and burrowing. Ah, uh, I guess not. Never mind. Wow, we really don't have a lot of, like, we've got a lot of recipes, but not a lot of them are actually very good. Plus for DV, not AV, or sorry, not um, agility. Mm -hmm. Oh, man. Pyrokinesis. Mm, I think we're out of uh, Hulk Honey zone. Oh, there's one more. No, that's awful. Quills. Okay. Not everything else, I'm missing ingredients. Let's uh, zoot up back to, there was one that was actually kind of okay. I guess we could do the Batman's cake with bone latkes, rich hulk honey, and grilled skulk. Sure. This one. Yeah. Mark it as a, we'll mark it as a favorite as well. Plus three quickness isn't bad. Cool. So, I mean, it's nice. Um, we have the potential to make that worthwhile. I think we're safe to auto explore. I think like there are obviously dangerous things here, but nothing that's going to kill us on the Wow, 25 damage on. Wow, that thing is ripping you apart, actually. You did kill it, though. So we can walk away. We now need to recover. I'm lush. You are lush. Lush is fine. I'm pretty sure lush is like What's totally happening? fine. Your acid covered is really the big problem. You could uh, spend some water to clean yourself off. 
There we go. No, I'm just last. There we go. Okay. Okay. It'll only take one dram. There. Now you're good. Let's do uh, rest. Cool. I did. Awesome. Uh, okay. I was just trying to figure out what the log was saying about a gold worm of the earth figurine. It's a strange one. You cleaned off your gold worm of the earth figurine. You know? I guess I had a gold worm of the earth figurine in my... And it was covered with the... Covered Nimbus beam is destroyed. Wait, what? I think some of your items are getting destroyed by acid. Can we have a quick look at your equipment? Throwing weapon is fine. Everything looks okay. We could, uh, like, go through each one and tr see if we can repair them. But I don't know if that's something you want to spend time doing. Okay, that's fine. What's broken? Well, uh, acid might be damaging them, so we want to make sure that we're maintaining. Yeah, just, like, go through each one. Sea bits are, like, super, super uh, abundant right now, so we're fine. Resync navigator is fine. That could use a repair. I think we, we did lose maybe some a trade bit. That's fine. That's... You can't repair that because it's part of you. <laughs> But it, that's fine. It can't be damaged as far as I know. That's fine. That needs a repair. And point defense drone. Oh, the nuclear cell is low. We could recharge it. Sure. Hmm. I like I say, that's good. We're that's gonna blow through those. Urchin, more urchins. Those are worth like some XP. We're very close to level 30. It's not going to, like, change the world or anything like that, but... Just one out. Well, you're standing right in it. <laughs> 262 XP. Oh, there it is. Oh. Excuse me, sir. Another elder lad, huh? We should be able to just, like, perma-stun them. And that is exactly how that went down. Did they die? Hard to tell. We didn't seem to get any XP. Well, they're dead. So elder beards aren't a problem for us. This is good. I do think that maybe tart beards are like on the easier end. If they were like um, still beards, that'd be kind of a problem. Flame beards are a big problem. Um... Sleep beards can be problematic. There's a flower there uh, casting darkness, basically. If you go uh -huh. northeast one, well, you've moved, so I don't... Go north like four and then do a control attack north. No, northwest one and then this that again. There. That is a Vanta Bloom. They uh, will have like things that you can cook with, but they cast a darkness and uh, they can actually be quite problematic. That one there was like a non-bloomed Vanta Bloom, like it was, it's, a, it's a flower, basically. And uh, if they bloom, then they actually cast like a ridiculously large um, sphere of, of darkness, which is pretty fun. Can be. There's another one. I don't know where that one is because we can't see it. Oh, and we're confused. Isn't that fun? I guess this is where, um, I forget what it's called. The gas grenade that is specifically against plants is actually quite useful. I think, I don't know if defoliage, urchins- Defoliage, defoliage grenade? Yeah, defoliage grenades. They can actually be quite helpful in these regards. We still haven't found our stairs, or have we? No, we found a chute, but we haven't found our stairs yet. I'm just glad it's like beards and not novice of the sightless way. The the purple gels are a little tough, I won't lie. The other one pretty quickly. You did, but you also dropped like a third of your health. We can fight it. It's mm. fine. You can't confuse a gel. You can't charge it. I was trying to charge. It's only one tile away. You're one tile away. You're... Wow. How could... I honestly don't... 
I, I don't know how you could have said that. That was nice. Oh, that was actually really easy. We're almost level 30. So close. One more kill will do it. One more kill will do it. Oh, stairs. <gasps> and there's an urchin. We can level up. Well. Done. Plus one to each attribute. We have done it. We might be high enough intelligent, finally. For I Tinker don't think 3. So. You don't think so? I do not think so. Do do Nope, never mind. Not even close. Oh, we're close. Mm. We're the closest we've ever been. We need two more points in intelligence. It's uh it's not gonna happen soon. We're at the like slowest progression part of cud. I didn't mean to do that. That's true. So Floor two of this historic site. Things are What's that? It, it's gonna something is on fire. <gasps> Another thermo cask. Disassemble those. The six bits are quite useful. Uh honestly, like we could consider selling them as well. They're not that heavy. 40 pounds isn't bad. Ooh. What's happening here? There's a lot of slinth is what's happening here. They're going to have lots of good stuff. Oh, he's got a Rhinox Skull Maul. That might actually be... Whoa! Holy Sorry, you crap. Look at that guy again. <laughs> Powered Exoskeleton. Flawless Crystal Gauntlets. Light Rail. That guy is a menace to society. Oh. I'm... Uh... Let's like back up one and then fight them. Because we don't want that guy to be able to shoot us at range while we're fighting someone else. So we can we can start punching. So we started punching. Well, he's already almost dead. These guys are very easy to kill for how much we get from them. Sorry, fans of Slinth. I like the Slinth too, but these guys are part of a cult. So just think of this as their Kool-Aid moment, okay? This is their Jonestown, okay? We're bringing the Jonestown to them. Look at all the stuff. Oh my god! Ah! <laughs> ah! What do we think? What do we think here? Oh, that's a lot of stuff. Good god. And you got the ceremonial vibro kopesh again. I hate you. We got. Crystal Warhammer, we've got a Rhinox. The Rhinox Skull Maul is actually really quite good. Apparently, it's as can, good. Can we? Yeah. Because this is all big, expensive stuff, right? Yeah, it is, and we're already over encumbered. We could pick it all up and then recoil. Where did we put a box? I don't know. Probably Ezra. That sounds right. I... I am so envious of this historic site. God, you and Narf. Where are my cool historic sites? God damn. Well, you live in fear. You didn't even want to come here. You're like, I don't want to go that way in the jungle. I'm Deep, ju Deep Jungle's got some shit that can instantly kill you. You gotta take chances. Make I take mistakes. chances all the time. They end up killing me. Get messy. Hence why I don't take them. Magic school bus. Ezra? Is that where we're... Yeah, we're going to Ezra. So, you're actually standing on it. So you'll have to do, like, interact and then uh, the wait key. Yeah. What do we got in here? We could probably put a cathedral in here. We didn't need to lug it around. Uh, plus sign. Here we go. All right. Oh, um, the Flawless Cursed Steel Gauntlets are better than what we're wearing, so we might want to, uh, actually swap up to those. Unfortunately, they won't be six-fingered, so we'll have to spend some bits, uh, modifying them again. Um. Okay, so, Cathedra, going in. Going in there. Oh, actually, don't put it in there. Sorry. Take it out. Take it out. Because I just realized something. Tell me. Uh, I'll tell you later. Ah! 
The suspense is killing me. Uh. All right. So I just pop all this stuff in here, and then we'll go through it. Pop everything in there except for the flawless ma crystal mace. Oh, is that that's what we're looking for? That's what right? we're looking for, and that's why we're not dropping the um, cathedra. There, I told okay. you. Okay. Yeah. Uh, yep. 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 It's amazing yep. how we got yep. all of this as, yep. as soon as you hit level 30, huh? Hmm. Uh, you wanted to hit enter on all of those. Some of those were multiples. Oh my gosh. Like, almost all of them are multiples. Finding that not to be the case. There we go. At least two of those were multiple. All right. Uh, there's only one mace, though, We right? can, yes. um, we can throw the jacked laser pistols in there. And maybe keep the light rail. Okay. Throw the hand vacuum that better, in there. Is that better than my gun? It could be, yeah. It's 13 pan and 1d12 damage. Throw the aguses in there. Remember when we sold those? I do. Good times. Good times. Um, my goodness. Okay, there's some stuff at the top. We're almost, we can almost move. <laughs> oh, Am yeah. Am keeping any of this stuff? Um, we're, we might swap to the coronet. Definitely throw the powered skeleton in there. The, okay. cor co the coronet is one AV higher. Mm. We're keeping the flawless crystal gauntlets. There's two power Sorry. skeletons. Just what the ass. God damn. <laughs> uh, throw the Kerma thermo cask in there. Throw the. You can move now. Throw the crystal shard mail, the crystal gauntlets, and um, we'll keep this for now. We're gonna look at your artifacts. All right. And transfer. Great. All right. All right. We can move again. All right. Um, we can have a quick look at six true and uh, Ela. After we've done this, of course. 23 pounds. One of these artifacts is very good. Ooh, a space, space inverter. Space inverter. Um, oh, do we have beam splitter? Like, as the mod? A gas tumbler. No, we don't. Oh. I've never heard those words before. Shoot. Okay. It's a gas tumbler. Uh, gas tumbler it's... makes your gas uh, emitting abilities more effective, which we have none oh. of right now, I don't think. So we, we, we would sell that or disassemble it. Sturdy handrail. Oh, okay. That's nice. No, that's a handrail. Different. The other one's a light rail. It's This is the pistol version of the, of the light rail. A pair, a of, pair boots. of boots. We've got boots. Boots on the moon. Ninefold boots. Oh, I think those are quite good. Um, what? Yeah. Ugh. Uh, you want to try it? See what it does? <laughs> I don't know. Well, its cell is empty, so we gotta... We'd have to replace the cell with something. I'm gonna do solar or biodynamic, or... Let's throw the combustion cell in there, since we actually have oil in that thing. And then auto-equip. Deactivate ninefold. I can turn them off. Yeah, well, we don't know what they do yet. What happens when you move around? Our movement is 100. Nothing really What are these exciting. dots that are flying at me? Yeah, I don't know. Whoop. Okay. I think it might be like a teleporty item. Whoop. Mmm. There's there's zoot there's zoot boots. Move nine tiles. So No, is it three? It's every three tiles? One, two. When I do a second one, a little orb comes for me. Yeah. Three does nothing. Four got me an orb. And I zooted. I feel like it's random. I don't think that the It, it does seem somewhat random. So they're, they're like, and you teleport in the direction you moved in, right? I'm moving in, yeah. Okay. Interesting, potentially helpful. I would probably disassemble them. I don't, I don't like, I don't like that. I don't like inconsistent movement like that. I mean, I well, know I we can- deactivate them. I know we can deactivate them, but they're all only worth and then they're a And then they're a get out of dodge boots. Yeah, I, that's true. If you want to roll with them, I, I won't stop you. Um, what can we do to them? Yeah, could we mod them with reinforce? That would help quite a bit. Sturdy willowy woolly. Nope. Willowy would be not bad because they weigh 10 pounds. They're actually quite heavy for boots. Um, swap out your gauntlets. I'm going to move on from this for a moment. <laughs> also, they do eat energy, so we'd have to put a better cell in them than that. Uh, you want to get rid of gauntlets? Yeah. Um, ghostly flames, I have a question huh? about my ghostly flames. <laughs> Yeah, I also have questions about your ghostly flames. W look at that. What is that? Why do we have ghostly flames for hands? I don't know. That's interesting. I don't know. Uh, Am I ghost rider now? 
Am I Ghost Rider? It might be to do with your ninefold boots, but you're, they're not activated right now. Very confused, honestly. I have a question about my ghostly flames. <laughs> uh, all right, well, we're going to ignore that for can now. Can I, like, can I, what if I, no? Nope. All right. Uh, look through your abilities, I wonder. Oh, tell me how. Well, you're going to leave this and then just page through your ability tab. I just want to see if you have any... No, I was just wondering if maybe they, uh, you had, like, Flame Ray or something. <laughs> Apparently not. Okay, well, that's a mystery. I'm just on fire. Let us know in the comments why we have Ghostly Flames. Why I'm on fire, yeah. And why are they good? I assume they're good. They might be good. They offer nothing, so far as I can tell. Yeah, okay. Am I cursed? Uh, maybe well your cybernetics. Fed, I'm what about your cybernetics? It's the only thing okay. I can think of. I equipment. Uh, 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 uh. Nope. Uh, uh, yeah. Still no. Okay. Tab to the right. Yeah, to the right. Well, you see the cybernetics at the top. You want to be there. You go. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, no, no, no. I have no idea. Maybe skin glitter. What is that on our? Oh, that's on that's our right on my arm. arm. Nope. I have no idea. That's a weird one. Truly, do not understand. Why okay. is my why are my wait? I have a, I got questions now. No, I got questions. I need to know. Do you want me to what look if it I up? take other things off? Okay. I wanted to make sure like my head also wasn't on fire. <laughs> well, they're not hurting you. I guess. Yeah, you want to put flawless crystal gauntlets on? Yeah, and I want to see how mu how expensive it is to put six fingered on that. Oh, we need. I need an AI microcontroller. Uh, okay, let's put the other ones back on and then uh, see if we can buy a AI, AI microcontroller from. Uh, Eid. Flames. They burn. I would suggest, um, we can have a quick look at the merchants here, but I would suggest we pick up the box and then recoil to Eid with it, and then we we place it in Eid. But let's have a quick look at what uh, um, Ela and Six True have. Okay, they do not have, uh, Ela does not have um, cybernetics. A bummer. Okay. Yeah, I mean, um, e Ezra is has been made kind of uh irrelevant now what with oh wow that w that was poor timing they've got some interesting artifacts we could find out oh we're inspired right now right um yes let's uh how many bananas do we have at least one we might want to buy some bananas while we're here mm. it's gonna be like all the way at the bottom four four uh let's let's grab some more but let's also make a meal I'm gonna I'm gonna show you a new meal. Uh, where do I go for bananas again? Um, just talk to any of the banana ranchers. They're the like kind of people roaming around. Yeah, that, that's like, yeah. That's that's one there. There's one to your north as well. I got. I want to buy your bananas. Sell me your bananas. You can okay. just buy them. Thank you, sir or madam. I think they're a hologram, actually. I Thank can't you. remember. Light bean. <laughs> Thank you, light based creature. And sold oh, by Tillywinks. You mean Tilly for Gawicks. Tilly for Gawicks. Tilly, Tilly for Gawicks. I, I know how to say their name, but they're Tiddlywinks. Because it's funny to me. Okay. Okay, um, so let's make a meal. Every time. Lol. Uh, yeah, you can preserve and choose ingredients. And we're looking for pickled mushrooms and banana. Pickled mushrooms, sun-dried banana. No third ingredient? Nope. This is a purely functional recipe. Okay, um... Whenever you eat a mushroom, you identify all artifacts on the local map. That's way better than vomiting. Exactly. Isn't that an improvement? I only kind of <laughs> caught on to this recently. Now, wine, the vine wafer sheaf combo is still good because it's cheaper. Mushrooms are more expensive to cook with, but... For things like this, it's very, very nice. You can also just eat any kind of mushroom ingredient. So if you go into your um, ingredients, you can also eat the horseshoe um, preserved, like freeze dry uh, horseshoes. You can eat those. Those count as mushrooms. There you go. Done. Now we can talk to Sixture and see what he, what um, kind of stuff he's got. Like their vomit is still there from all the times we. Oh my God, he's got pet metamorphic poly gel. <laughs> We want that. We want that. Yeah, we can afford it. We yeah. have so much crap. Yeah. Let's, let's sell our gas tumbler. Apparently, it's like highly worth it. 
Okay. I know it's like worth Ooh. bits to us as well, but it's not worth the bits that we need, so we may as well sell it. Ooh. Um, probably want to sell our woolly steel boots. Wait, do we have crystal boots? I believe so. Okay. Yeah, this is fine. Yeah, let's just do that. That's fine. We're going to be I doing mean, more training. If we training. don't, he's also selling them, so we could get some. Yeah, yeah. True. But I think we put some in the box. I don't think we have flawless crystal boots is the only thing. Uh, anything else? Uh, I'm sure there is. I mean, there's tons of stuff in the box. Mm, no, that's about it. Base inverter? Sell the... Uh, the sturdy handrail would be perfect. It's like exactly the same price. Well, that's... But it's also lighter. Just do that then. Okay. Mm. So like the gas... Whatever you want to do, man. I don't know. Throw like one cell at this just to even it up. Cells are up, aren't they? They are, yeah. Here, your beaded bracelet is like ideal. Well, there's a slight delay. Stop it. Unfortunately. So I, I see things after you've done them by about five... Not Maybe not five seconds, three seconds. Stop it. Stop it. There we go. Great. Done. Tell me, what the what the f did I just buy? Um, you bought a. It hungers for freedom. <laughs> it's a good dis description. You basically bought a cloning goo, but it's specifically for <laughs> items, so you can clone any okay. item. Okay. Um, All this right. also works for liquids. So this is something that Nerf uh, has told, caught, um, kind of like taught me is like we could use it on actual cloning gel and then use all of the cloning gel to clone um, tiddlywinks in Eat Freehold so that we have more tiddlywinks in the world. Spacer rifle. Wait a minute. Spacer rifle? Maybe... Only 2,928 waters. We're not in lack of money. We've got an entire chest full of crystal goods. Um, what's the What's the accuracy on that? Have a look at that. High. High versus our light rail, which is what? I don't know. We can look at it in our uh, yeah on our side. Sorry, these these are important questions. Light rail is only one less pen. It's very high. Yeah, I think we want to keep our light rail. The benefit to the spacer rifle is it does damage in as plasma, so like mm. we could make like that makes thermal grenades really really powerful, or freeze grenades. Like the spacer rifle offers opportunities to us. Um, we're definitely upgrading from our sniper rifle. I think you'll be pleased to hear either way. So what do you think? What, 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 what sounds good to you? I, that. Yeah. What, how much ammo do they hold? It really is a question that I can't, I, I don't know. It, they both use energy and they're definitely going to vary in how much energy they eat up. We still haven't found an antimatter cell yet, um, which is like the best battery in the game. Um, we're working with kind of limited power with our nuclear cells. They're okay, but they could be. I say, here's what I'm going to say. Since we have so much money right now, let's buy it. Um, we'll try both it and the light rail out. You can decide after what, how you feel about it. If you don't like the plasma rifle, if you end up not liking it, it's worth a AI microcontroller. So we could use it to improve our other gun. Also, um, Regardless of the fact that the spacer pipe rifle is only high accuracy, this is before we modify it with like, you know, masterwork and um, scoped. Um, I don't, we can't do drum loaded because they don't use ammo, but you know. Uh, uh, I'm gonna have to get some stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah sorry. I, won't buy it. I didn't mean for you to try to buy it now. You need to go and uh, collect a bunch of your trade goods. It's too bad we don't have reprogrammable. Um, we don't have a reprogrammable uh, recoiler, right? No. Okay. Um, so yeah, let's grab... We could potentially play with a powered exoskeleton later, so maybe we'll we'll keep one, but like, grab one, grab the crystal shard mail, grab the gauntlets. Sorry, uh, people at home, but, um, you know, this is this is apparently the uh, item management episode. Because okay. we, we, we basically just made a, a breakthrough. We're going to get all of this done in this episode. And in the next episode, we may be doing Tomb of the Eaters. Because this was this was everything. Um, yeah, grab one of those. Grab the Thermo Cask. Since we do have the ability to carry that. Um, was there anything else? There was, uh, There's a ton of weapons. We'll, we'll leave those for now since we can't carry all of that. You could maybe... Uh, I don't know. Holy shit. The Rhinox skulls are... 
25 each all right let's just let's start with what we've got okay the the big brain is if it, if we don't have enough we can drop all of that stuff right in front of six true and then go and get some more and then pick it all up and then sell it to him do 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 i guess we could sell the it's only one av higher definitely we sell the thermo cask and like we're already there basically i'd also like to buy that um i'd like it if you could buy that uber nostrum that showing its face at the bottom all right so uh what can we do we have an, enough to even this up mm. oh we've got a ton of jewels we can even this up no problem i mean i can get rid of the space inverter rail and space inverter yeah let's do let's do the uh, space inverter it's a cool item um you can actually get an achievement with it if that interests you but i don't think it does it does not let's uh there, look they couldn't be more spot on with this trade if you tried well, actually, you go. probably could. But I won't. One dram. Cool. Okay. We're not done. Do we want to we end this episode? I don't know how long we've been. Well, um, I kind of don't because we're going to hit some milestones. Uh, we, I, it, we're, we're like lengthwise, we're at the end of the episode. If you're okay to keep going, there's a couple of boxes I want to check because on the next one, we'll be, we'll be on a fresh start, basically. We'll be ready to take on the world. Okay. Let's, let's do it. All right, so um, we're going to need to access a Becoming Nook. We're going to go to Eid Freehold. Um, I'd recommend grabbing that chest and then tell, uh, recoiling, because we're going to need trade goods. Hello, sir. It's one of my favorite wardens in the entire game. How do I game. pick up chest again? Uh, look at it. Mmm. Get. Get. Attack. Uh, break my heart. How to destroy me psychically for free. I'm a little worried that Eid Freehold Recoiler is uh, going to be out of juice, but it's fine. Very low. Well, still be good. Nope. nope. Bummer. I uh, can replace recharge it. You can. Uh, we're getting low on those bits. Sure, go for it. Well, whatever. Let's, what do we replace it with? Um, Solar cell? Yay. It worked. All right. I recommend putting the chest like right next to you instead of like on your position because yeah. it'll be a little bit easier. What's it under? Miscellaneous, I think. Yeah, 290 pounds in miscellaneous. Do, do, do. Drop. Well, it didn't give yeah, me the option. It's fine. I mean, I could pick it up and drop it again. Yep, we definitely could. All right. Well, I leave the option the to you. you we're, we're running late, so. Great. Cool. Um, First thing we want to do is go to the tinker shop. You want to pick some stuff up before we go? Um, Yeah. Let's grab a few things because we've got a hundred pounds to play with. Um, grab some weapons. Let's grab like all the Rhinox skull malls. Those are the heaviest, and we want to get rid of the heavy stuff first. Oh yeah, we're not in we're not in uh, take mode really. This this is fine. Um, grab the jacked laser pistols because those sell for quite a lot. This is just a, an insurance to make sure that we can we can pay for what we want. Um, flawless crystal aguses, they weigh quite a bit. They're at the bottom. Cool. That's it. All we we're, can do. Yeah, we're exactly... That That was perfect. All right. You want to go to... Uh, workshop. You should be able to hit V and then it'll auto do it. But... That's wrong. Okay. All right. Who do you want to talk to? We want to talk to the frog lad. We also have some rocks we can tumble, but I know that's like super not priority right now. And yet, I'm doing it first. Uh, that one. Yep. And that one. Yep. Oop. I just love this. I love that you can do that and it actually improves the value of them. Bip. Bip. Okay. Dysfunctional AI master unit. He has, I think, two AI microcontrollers. That was good. That's good because we were hoping for exactly that. <gasps> oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. You're excited about something, but I don't know what. Uh, let's buy dysfunctional AI micro master units first. Just throw those on there. Both of them. Yeah. Mm-hmm um yeah we want to buy the top two thing the ontological anchor no 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 the top two data discs my my bad mm. sorry scaled and serrated yeah okay cool um yeah we buy those we also uh we still are under the effects of our last meal we want to eat a mushroom on this current screen when you're done making that trade what are we selling uh just whatever weapon makes sense probably a rhinox small yeah that works out yeah. almost perfectly almost perfectly 100 drams is actually kind of hard to oh yeah i guess I'm... yeah sure I'll it won't two. it won't encumber us that's the important part mm, go yeah oof 
Okay, no, note will have to uh, shed some water. Okay, um, let's eat a mushroom and just check what that uh, weird artifact is. Just caves of cud stuff, you know? I don't know what this thing is. Let me eat a mushroom real quick. Can either do pickled or freeze dried. There's not really much diff. Uh, oh, it was a <coughs> cybernetic high fidelity, high fidelity matter recompositor. What does that do? I think that's phasing. Alifino. Teleport to a chosen explored space on the map. Oh, that's actually quite cool. But uh, we're not going to be able to wear that, I don't think, because that's going to take body, the... Uh, body body. Yeah. It's it's really nice. I like that item a lot, actually. Oh, well. Okay. Uh, now we want to probably check out Tiddlywinks, and then we want to go to the Becoming Nook. The real I'm just going to buy some bit. Yeah, that's not a bad idea. Just to, like, get rid of some water. Perfect. Yeah, it's fine. Okay. That's a that's a very good idea. Okay. We can grab our gems. Oh, the gems. The gems. Also, you can you can walk on that table. I know it doesn't make sense, but oh, oh the, the topaz, topaz isn't ready yet. Just like wait like two turns probably. He's doing anything. There we go. Uh, 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 uh. All right. All right. Where are we going? We're going to Tiddlywinks. You here? No. No. Go up. Yep. We go east to the market 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 t yeah there we go down do 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 okay do a quick scroll by. I don't think that they will have anything worthwhile to us right now, but it's worth checking. Ah, he's got a space inverter. Wow. He's got a That's gold it. nugget. It's really the best thing he's got is a gold nugget. Um, okay. Well, um, you don't have to buy that. Or, and I won't. All right. Let's, uh, let's go to the Becoming Nook. I go up. I go to the, that's the wrong button. I go to the convalescence quarter. Quarter. Hello, hello, sir. Go down. Now I become. Well, okay, so here's your moment. Um, what we want to do is yeah, um, we want to know how much these costs before we do this, like how much they give us, because we don't know, we, you know, we've gotten some, we've upgraded our license a couple times since we last looked. I know that the Cathedra is 12. So the question is, um, do we want to get rid of the hand bones? Is there some yeah. other way we can do it? Okay, let's just do it. Just go for it. I can't imagine this process is pleasant. Okay, so now we have 11 points. So we're going to have to get rid of skin glitter. I know that's crazy. No! I know! It's only worth one point. But that's exactly how much we need. Um, I have terrible news. What's up? Didn't we put it in the box? No, we, no, I we told you not to, to. Yeah, I told you not to. Did I listen is the question? Yes, I'm pretty sure you did. There it is. Oh, it goes on our back. We could go buy that teleporty thing, except it's 12 points also. So, like, ain't no way we're ever going to wear all of it. Oh, God, I am, like, supremely jealous right now. 
have the ability stunning force. You do. So that is that. We have become um, quite a monster. Uh, worn on back implant. We can have a look at it. Okay. I'm not sure what it like. What is this exactly? We have plus it's a three cool ego. Jet pack, I think. We get extra health, extra move speed, extra carrying capacity, the ability to fly, ego. Uh, it's just like. Yeah. No, this is just a cool jet pack. Shaped it's... like a cathedral. I I am I am so envious. That is ridiculous. Invoke a concussive force in the surrounding area, throwing enemies back and stunning them. That's pretty fun. That's pretty fun. Compute power on the local lattice increases this item's effectiveness. We might want to look into that in the future. I'll have to do a little bit of research on that. It can't be uninstalled. We're stuck with this. That's that's that. It's a good thing to be stuck with, but good lord. All right. Um, we want to throw in our fist before we forget. Have we been using our Aegis to fight? Sure the heck, hope not. Mm, We're almost no. done. It's, it looks like our Aegis is the primary for now, but it might have switched when we got rid of our weapon. Um, throw yeah. our uh, cudgel in our fist and then switch our primary. I mean, you can... Do it that I'm way. Doing the opposite. All right. And then uh, let's look at mod uh, with tinkering on Flawless Crystal Mace. Okay. Um, we still don't have a lot of mods, to be honest. We might want to hold did off. Buy on a this. bunch of stuff we haven't used. Yeah, but we're not tinkering three yet. Or oh, I see. Um, you can learn serrated. Serrated is gonna be for knives. I just like it a lot. We can't learn that, but hey. Um, okay. Well, why don't we hold off on modding the Crystal Mace for now? I think we're, I think we're ready. I think Tomb of the Eaters is calling us. We're level 30. It's not, uh, you know, like it, it's an okay level to be at for Tomb of the Eaters. Um, we can, yeah, we can look at Spacer Rifle or Light right Rail. Maybe we want to do like a test run on either, like just roam around the the wastes and see which one we like. Um, we can mod them. That's a good point. You could put like scoped. I almost always recommend scoped on on them. We could put scoped on either of them or both of them even. Oh, you know, I could just look at them in my inventory, but I'm doing it the weird way. Spacer rifle will probably be an eight bit to mod. No. Oh, seven bit. So they're the same. Neither the other one's a six bit. Oh, you're right. You're right. This one, I mean, it, we. I guess let's try them before we mod them because you you could actually mod the spacer rifle twice. You could get it to masterwork scoped, um, because it'll ask for a, a meta crystal on the second one. Okay. Okay. Well, uh, that's a big deal episode. We we've done it. We have done quite a lot. Uh, we'll probably shove all the stuff back in our chest um, after we're done. Might want to switch to like some crystal boots or just normal boots than the uh, ninefold, but I mean, they're they're pretty cool. We have extra movement speed is the other thing. Like that, I I can't I cannot understate just how good that is. Like you are gonna be able to basically just walk away from dudes without them being able to hurt you, and that's incredibly powerful. And with charge as well, you have like the option of just like backing away from someone and then charging them and stunning them that way. It's it's insane. It's wonderful. I I I am very envious of this build now. So we've done it. Next episode, we're gonna be doing big stuff. We'll either start Tomb of the Eaters or we will roam around. We'll see. Maybe let us know in the comments. I don't know when we'll be recording next, so. If you are enjoying the series, definitely hit the like button, consider subscribing, and uh, closing thoughts? We got a cool jetpack. Heck yeah.